What's up guys, back to another video and today this is part one of Fibonacci. So the Fibonacci sequence is a series of numbers, you might know it. It's well it starts with a zero, one, one, two, three, five, eight, thirteen, twenty one, thirty four. You get that by adding the number four since one plus zero equals one. One plus one equals two, two plus one equals Three, three equals two equals five, five, three equals eight, eight equals five equals thirteen, thirteen plus eight equals twenty one, twenty one plus thirteen equals thirty four, and the next number would be fifty five because thirty four plus twenty one is fifty five. And then the next number is found by adding up the two numbers before it. So see it's thirty four if it, this equals thirty four, then it's thirty four because twenty one and thirteen is thirty four. Yeah, the two is found. Then four, one and one, three is found by adding the two numbers before one and two. Five is ten. Three and so on. the next one of sequence is fifty-five. Is that this is that example? Here's a longer list. So you can it just goes on forever. So it's just like zero, one, one, two, three, five, eight, thirteen, twenty-one, thirty-four, fifty-five. 589, 144, 233, 377, 647, 687, 1,509, 9,887, 1,598, so. And it keeps on going like that, 10, it's my uh, my YouTube channel. It's my profile picture. So, mm -hmm. so it's just so you do one. The first number is one. Then it's one again. And just adds like the corners. Boom, boom, corner, 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 and then it keeps on, and then and it just makes a nice spiral because you're just adding some of the corners, see, and uh, it's always touching a corner, 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 for every number it touches at least one corner, <laughs> two corners, yeah, at least two corners, so, that's the golden spiral, you can have the squares fit near, nearly together, for example, 5 and 8 make 13, 8 and 13 makes, and so on, the spiral is found in nature, yes, you can see it, like, different numbers of spirals. If you look closely on the number of petals and stuff, then it, or first you can see the pet, uh, the spiral in here, but you can also, like, on the number of petals on a flower, it's always one of the Fibonacci sequence numbers. So it's one of these and so on. So it's always one of those. And the rule is Zero, one, two, three. So this is the fourteenth number. The first number, or the zeroth number, is zero. First number is one. Second number is one. Third number is two. Fourth number is three. Fifth number is five. Sixth number is eight. Seventh number is thirteen. Eighth number is twenty-one, and that keeps on going. So the fourteenth number is three hundred seventy-seven. So the term called six is called x six, which is the sixth number is eight. The eighth term. It's the seventh term plus the sixth term. So see, this is the eighth term. It's the seventh term plus the sixth term. Thirteen plus eight equals twenty-one. So we can write the rule. The rule is x n equals x n minus one plus x n minus two. Basically, so this plus this equals this. So n. Then, yeah, so the term 9 is calculated like this, x9 equals x9 minus 1 plus x9 minus 2. See, since you're adding, so x9, x9 is right here. And then it's by, it's by adding x9, 34, and, or 9 minus 1 is 8, which is x, or which is, x8, which is 21, plus you add x9 minus 2, so you add x9 minus 2, which is 7, 
and which means 13, so you just need to add 13 and 21, that equals 34. See, 21 x8 plus x7 equals 21 plus 13 equals 34. So the golden ratio is 1.68 to 1. 1.618 to 1. And you can create golden rectangles with it. Well, it goes on and goes on, but that's just like the normal, the first few numbers. And um, you can create golden rectangles with it. It's also found in the human face, which is really cool. And um, yeah, so I guess I'll start with the next video, part two. So I guess I'll see you next time. Bye.